going by the recent developments, it seems that the ride hailing application and the EV segment company, Ola, is vouching for homegrown technologies in the country. It recently exited from Google Maps completely. Last week, Bhavish Agarwal, the CEO of Ola, announced that they are completely exiting Google Maps. The aim was to reduce its dependency on Google Maps and also come up with its own homegrown technology, that is Ola Maps. It says that the company will be able to save at least 100 crores a year by using Ola Maps. Ola Maps will have added features such as inner navigation, 3D navigation, and also drone, drone mapping, and many more features which will be added in the coming months. This move has been aimed at showing less dependent on standard technologies as well as proprietary softwares. Mr. Agarwal said that Ola is completely exiting Microsoft Azure platform because it also wants to capitalize on its homegrown Kritrim AI, which it developed recently. Kritrim AI is now a unicorn and it's a separate company which works in, within Ola. All these homegrown technologies will have steady and significant advantage for Ola. First of all, it will be able to provide better services to its customers and also internal efficiencies will increase within Ola itself. The cloud platform has a capability to do multitasking. It will help Ola analyze huge chunks of data which will be generated through its EV segment as well as through the Ola maps. The ride sharing data plus the map data which will be generated by the EVs, the scooters, the two-wheeler segment will also be analyzed by this homegrown platform. Through this, it is also being aimed that it will better Ola's chances in the forthcoming IPO. It will increase investor interest in the company and helping the organization move ahead with success in the stock market. Another homegrown technology which Ola has developed is the Bharat cell. It claims that it is an indigenous developed cell technology which has received approval from the Bureau of Indian Standards and which will be manufactured in its gig factory in Tamil Nadu. It says that it will revolutionize the EV segment in the country and help it be moved towards a leadership position in the EV segment in the nation.